Mark wasn't usually one to pick up trash from the ground. But when he noticed how a trash bag was strangely moving around, he couldn't resist. He carefully crouched down and untied the trash bag. He was prepared for a group of rats to jump out and run away, but instead he saw something that left his heart pounding. Mark quickly reached for his phone and dialed 911, hoping they could be here in time. Mark had driven for almost five hours when he finally decided it was time for a well-deserved break. It was around 5 p.m., so he stopped at a truck stop near a highway restaurant to get something to eat. He still had about eight hours of driving to go, as he had to be at his destination by tomorrow morning. He was finishing up his cigarette, ready to head into the restaurant, when he suddenly heard a rustling sound coming from the other side of his truck. At first, he thought it was just someone throwing away the trash, but as the rustling sound continued, he feared it could be someone standing a little too close to his pride and joy. His truck. He! He yelled, but no one answered. He irritatedly threw his cigarette on the ground and stepped on it as he walked to the other side of the truck. He! He yelled again, expecting so see someone, but there was no one there. Mark frowned. He could have sworn the sound was coming from here, so why didn't he see anyone? He turned around, ready to finally get something to eat, when he heard the same rustling sound again. He whipped around, but still, there was no one there. He did notice an orange trash bag lying next to a trash container. As his eyes lingered on the trash bag, he suddenly saw it move, making the same rustling sound as before. Mark froze, staring at the trash bag as it began to move around. There was something inside trying to get out. Mark hesitated. Should he open the bag? What if there were a group of rats inside and they bit him? He couldn't risk going to the emergency room and missing his deadline. He turned around to leave but hesitated. What if another animal needed help? He remembered reading about abandoned puppies and couldn't ignore the possibility. Sighing, he approached the trash bag and poked it cautiously. The movement inside stopped abruptly. Mark waited then poked again, hearing an unfamiliar sound this time. Confused, he glanced around, noticing people watching. Feeling self-conscious, he stood up and smiled awkwardly. After they left, he untied the bag slowly, feeling his heart race. As he opened it, he braced himself, expecting the worst. But there was nothing dangerous. Peering inside, he spotted a tiny paw among the garbage. Realization hit him, and he called 911 for help, urging them to hurry. His heart pounded. How did this happen? Were there more? Spotting another orange bag nearby, he quickly secured the first bag in his truck and rushed to check the others. He really hoped there wasn't an animal inside all of them, or else this would be a long night. Mark opened them up one by one. Some also had animals inside, even two, but luckily, most were just filled with trash. He collected all the bags with animals in his truck, keeping them warm until the cops and animal control arrived but time was ticking, and he could only hope they would be here in time. Mark stood anxiously at the truck stop, watching the arriving authorities. The blaring sirens drew curious glances from other truckers. As the officers approached, Mark took a deep breath, ready to recount the surreal events. He pointed to his truck, its cargo more bizarre than anyone could guess. With the officers gathered around, Mark led them to his truck, revealing his unexpected find. I was checking the perimeter when I noticed these bags moving, he explained, gesturing to the bags he had carefully placed inside. The officers looked on in disbelief as Mark described how he found animals inside some of them. His voice was a mix of concern and bewilderment, unable to fathom who would do such a thing. As Mark shared his story, other officers began canvassing the area, piecing together information about unusual activities. Whispers and speculations floated in the air, with everyone trying to make sense of the strange occurrence. Inside the security room, officers scanned through hours of footage, searching for any anomaly. Outside, the area around Mark's truck had become an active investigation scene. Animal control personnel transferred the animals to their vehicles, ensuring their safety. Mark watched from a distance, his mind racing with questions and concern, the mystery had just begun to unravel. 
Mark sat across from a police officer, his story unfolding under the interrogation room light. He recounted the sequence of events, his voice steady but his hands trembling slightly. The officer listened intently, taking notes as Mark described each detail with precision. In his narrative, Mark painted a vivid picture of the night. I was about to leave when I heard this rustling, he began, his eyes reflecting the memory. It was odd, out of place, so I checked, and that's when I found the bags moving. He described how upon realizing there were animals inside, he didn't hesitate to call 911, his voice urgent and decisive. As Mark spoke of the animals, his concern was palpable. I just couldn't leave them there. Not like that, he said, his voice tinged with emotion. He expressed deep worry for their well-being, emphasizing their vulnerability and helplessness. The officer nodded, understanding the gravity of Mark's concern, and reassured him that the animals were now in safe hands. Recognizing Mark's critical role, the police extended their gratitude. Your quick thinking made all the difference, the leading officer said, offering a firm, appreciative handshake. They assured Mark that the case was now a top priority and that they would thoroughly investigate. The atmosphere was one of solemn determination, mixed with gratitude towards Mark's intervention. Before leaving, Mark offered further assistance. If there's anything more I can do, just let me know, he said earnestly. The officers thanked him, acknowledging his offer. With a final look at the scene, Mark climbed back into his truck, his mind replaying the night's events. As he started the engine, he took a deep breath, ready to continue his journey, his heart heavier, but filled with a sense of having done the right thing. Back at the truck stop, a breakthrough came when an officer reviewing security footage spotted something crucial. On the grainy screen, a suspicious vehicle emerged from the shadows of the night. The footage revealed more as they watched. The mysterious vehicle stopped at various points around the truck stop, dropping off bags unseen by the sparse crowd. Determined to glean more information, investigators zoomed in on the footage, hoping to capture the vehicle's license plate number. In the makeshift command center, the police team huddled around a map, discussing potential leads from the footage. They analyzed timings, the vehicle's path, and the partial license plate. After intense discussion, the decision was made to pursue the vehicle as a significant lead. Teams were assigned to trace it, check for similar incidents, and canvas potential witnesses. As the truck stop faded into the distance, Mark found himself back on the open road, his journey resumed, yet his mind far from at ease. The images of the night's events played on a loop in his head, the quiet hum of the engine a stark contrast to the chaos he had left behind. Though moving forward, a part of him remained tangled in the mystery. With each mile, Mark's thoughts drifted back to the mysterious vehicle and the fate of the animals. He wondered about their origin and intended destination. The road stretched endlessly, its monotonous scenery backdrop to his contemplations. Questions without answers floated in his mind, mingling with concern shadowing his heart. The memory of the trapped animals lingered, haunting his thoughts. Their frightened eyes and trembling within the trash bags left a heavy feeling in his chest, a scene to stay with him. As he drove, Mark hoped for a swift resolution to the case, justice for the animals. They need someone to answer for this, he muttered, his voice a blend of anger and determination. The road seemed longer, every mile marker a reminder of the unresolved mystery. Mark couldn't shake his concern, his mind repeatedly wandering back to the animals and the ongoing investigation. The police traced the suspicious vehicle to a local farm. As squad cars pulled up, anticipation filled the air. The tranquil farm appeared ordinary, complicating the investigation. The officers exchanged glances, wary not to be swayed by appearances. They knew the truth might be hidden beneath this pastoral veneer. The officers explored the farm, looking for any link to the incident at the truck stop. Despite a thorough search, evidence remained elusive. A promising clue bag similar to those found proved confounding upon inspection. The bags were common, used for various legitimate purposes, leaving investigators puzzled. The evidence was inconclusive, deepening rather than clarifying the mystery, leaving more questions behind. 
the investigation at the farm raised doubts among the police team. While nothing overtly incriminating was found, they couldn't shake the feeling that something was off. The farm, with its everyday facade, seemed to hold secrets just out of reach. As they left, their thoughts were filled with the puzzle of the farm, a complex piece in the larger, still unsolved mystery. As Mark drove, a news report mentioned a local farm under investigation linked to a recent incident at a truck stop. Intrigued, he decided to detour to the farm, seeking closure or understanding. Arriving, Mark felt a mix of apprehension and intrigue. The unknown loomed large as he observed from a distance, scanning for anything unusual. From his vantage point, the farm seemed ordinary, almost too much so. Mark's eyes searched for clues, but found none, deepening the mystery. As he watched, Mark's concern grew. What was the truth behind this seemingly peaceful farm? Were they involved, or was it coincidence? The lack of clear answers gnawed at him. While he couldn't intervene directly, his curiosity and concern remained, a silent companion on his journey. Surveying the farm, something caught his eye. Signs of excessive animal presence and makeshift enclosures. These subtle signs fueled his suspicion, hinting at a hidden reality. The more he observed, the more pieces fell into place. Could this farm be a link in the chain of events he had stumbled upon? The possibility turned over in his mind, each observation adding weight to his theory. Determined to gather more information, Mark struck up conversations with locals at a nearby diner, subtly asking about the farm and its activities. The locals shared stories and rumors that hinted at a farm with more to it than met the eye. Each piece of information added to Mark's conviction that something was wrong. Taking responsibility, Mark called the police, detailing his observations and the information from the locals. His firm message caught the officer's attention, adding a new angle to the investigation. As Mark continued his journey, he felt a sense of accomplishment, hopeful that justice would prevail. Buoyed by Mark's information, the police intensified their efforts at the farm, uncovering hidden areas hinting at illegal activities. Further investigation revealed evidence of animal trafficking, shocking the officers. A breakthrough linked the animals found at the truck stop to those at the farm, deepening the gravity of the case. With each new piece of evidence, the extent of the trafficking operation became clearer. The confirmation of the farm's involvement marked a turning point, leading to coordinated efforts to dismantle the trafficking ring across multiple states. Officers diligently pursued leads, dismantling the trafficking network piece by piece, bringing it from the shadows into the light of justice. Key figures in the operation were identified and arrested, met with a mix of surprise, resistance, and resignation. Each arrest underscored the accountability of those involved, with authorities emphasizing the consequences they would face. Mark's pivotal role in the investigation was publicly acknowledged by the police in a small ceremony, honoring his contribution as a true Good Samaritan. The arrests sent a clear message against animal trafficking, marking a significant victory for animal rights and the rule of law. Reflecting on his unexpected involvement, Mark found a renewed belief in the power of doing the right thing, carrying with him a sense of accomplishment. Meanwhile, rescued animals began their journey of rehabilitation, receiving dedicated care from animal welfare organizations and veterinarians. As they found their forever homes, each adoption became a celebration of hope and compassion symbolizing new beginnings. Mark formed a special bond with some of the animals during a visit, a poignant reminder of the impact of his actions. The case took an unexpected turn when a rare breed among the rescued animals linked it to a high-profile missing pet, shedding further light on the issue of animal trafficking. In solitude, Mark reflected on the far-reaching consequences of his journey, a profound reminder of the power of empathy and the unpredictable nature of life.